Hey guys, so Jose R2 and today we the Leaping Lego Lake City Crook. So this is uh, the box here. So you can see it's a uh, very big, and yeah, uh, this is my hand compared to it. And yeah, that's a really big problem here. But you know, you can see um, this is a uh, set zero two zero three six, and comes with two hundred and nine eight pieces, and it's recommended for your six to twelve, and comes with uh, two main figures, a worker, and also the driver, I believe, and. Yeah, uh, so this is the top, uh, so you can see you got the handle here, and the uh, extra size, so, yeah. So this is the side of the box here, uh, both sides, uh, they are all the same. So this is the bottom of the box here, so you can see, uh, you know, just some warning stuff. And the back of the box here, uh, you can see, shows you all the features, and... You know, like, yeah, so that's it for the box. So inside does come with uh, this cray thing here, which is uh, really big uh, too, because, you know, uh, the box is big. But, yeah, so this is the instruction manual here. So you can see, it's uh, kind of short. It, uh, it seems like they, it's uh, kind of like cut it out, so... Yeah, I'm not sure why, but yeah, does have a numbered backs in this set, so that's great. And yeah, so this is the end of the build. Uh, the back just shows you all the features, just like the back of the box. So yeah. So the first main figure here is the driver. So you can see, uh, you got the, his uh, happy kind of face, and yeah, the torso printing looks very really good. You got the button, and you know. Uh, you got some uh, lines there, and yeah, no leg printing, and yeah, doesn't have any back printing too, uh, no double set face, so yeah, that's it for the driver. So the second main figure here is the worker, so you can see he has uh, his uh, red hat, and you know, uh, his face looks pretty good, you got uh, his uh, glasses there, and yeah, the torso printing, uh, you got this uh, kind of buckle thing, you know, and yeah, you got this uh, kind of pouch part or the pocket, and yeah, so the back printing looks really good too. You know, the continuation printing of the uh, the shirt, and yeah, so that's it for the worker may figure. So uh, these are all the Lego boxes in the set, and also you got a little crawly. So this crawly is just in red, and you know the worker can hold it, I guess. And yeah, so let's take a look at the boxes here. So you can see uh, you got nine of them, and yeah, uh, three of uh, each of these, and you know they are all stickers, definitely not printed though, but. Yeah, so I guess uh, these like brick, uh, these box on um, brick pieces, I guess they are supposed to have like uh, two or three boxes and like these ones on plates, uh, I guess they are supposed to have only maybe like two. So yeah, you got this uh, firefighter set, I'm not sure what it is, but you know it does have uh, the firecraft and also the cities right there. So yeah, and you also got the this set right here, you know. Uh, pretty accurate to the box there and yeah it looks very good and the last one here is the uh, police car set which I'm not sure if uh, Lego made it before or not but yeah it's uh, pretty cool I guess but yeah so that's it for all of the boxes and the crawly so this is the crook and the trailer build so let's start off by take a look at the uh, crook first so this is the crook build here so you can see the front here got uh, the license plate which is a uh, sticker piece and you also got the headlights which have also have these uh the signal lights on the side and yeah so on this side and see you got the little door there uh, just for show and yeah, you also got uh, this window here, and you got this little steps uh, for the driver to climb up. And you also, you also got this step piece, uh, which I'm not sure what it is for, but you also got some more steps on the back. And yeah, so on the back here, you can see uh, you got the tail lights and also the back license plate. 
and yeah so here we got uh, this piece which is uh, for the trailer to uh, connect it connect into this uh, truck and you also got these uh, uh, exhaust yeah this side it's uh, pretty much the same except that uh, this uh, this little stud is on a uh, different position yeah um, the other side uh, the stud here is uh, one stud to over here so yeah that's just that and yeah so let's take a look at the interior so uh, the interior here you can see uh, it's on this ratchet piece and you can just remove it and yeah a lot of people have uh, problems uh, with uh, this part right here but I don't really have any but yeah so inside you can see you got uh, the seat with uh, the coffee mug and you also got a uh, little steering wheel there and you got this bunk bed on the back and you also got this uh, TV screen right there which uh, is a pretty weird screen they could have just used another sticker but yeah so overall really cool little interior so let's uh, let's take a look at the uh, trailer part so this is the uh, trailer part here so you can see you got this uh, really big uh, leaping logo on the side there and yeah so uh, the bottom here you can see you got this uh, the stand thing which is made out of, uh, of these um, uh, binocular pieces and yeah you can move them up uh, if this thing is uh, connected to uh, the truck and yeah so this is the piece that connects uh, to that uh, the other piece that I just showed you just now and yeah but it's uh, it's very easy if you get uh, disconnected so that's kind of a problem there but yeah so the back view you can see they kind of made it like a uh, suspen suspension little part but yeah uh, it does uh, sometimes fall off which is really annoying but yeah so let's uh, open this so the back here you can see you got the tail lights and you know you also got the license plate and you got the Leapin logos on the door and yeah the door you can just uh, simply just open it up and inside is uh, nothing it's hollow so yeah but uh, so on uh, each side you can see you got a uh, side little door so yeah but uh, the top here you can see you got these uh, red lights and you also got these uh, transparent lights or studs but yeah so the top is uh, all just uh, uh, plate pieces and yeah so let's connect it to the crook so all you, ha all you have to do is just simply just push this up and put the crook right here and you just connect it the bottom part to that part right in the middle and yeah this thing is uh, connected so yeah but uh, like sometimes when you put it off the the piece that is holding it uh, will come off sometimes not so well connected right there so yeah that's a problem but you know like overall it's uh, yeah it's pretty cool so um, that's it for all of the builds so overall conclusion of this set so how do I think of it uh, well the set here is uh, great because you know it's uh, retired uh, for like uh, five years already so you know it's uh, nice to get it and yeah like the quality of this set can suck you know everything just falls apart yeah like that's the biggest problem of the set like yeah the main figure uh, the main figures it's okay and you know I especially like these uh, mini boxes and yeah they look pretty cool but it's just that the crook and the trailer build they all just the uh, the build itself it's just uh, everything just keeps falling off so yeah I kinda hate the quality of the set so I'm not sure if I can recommend it but yeah if you if you really like the set if you like really want the set then yeah I do recommend you getting it it's just uh, you might want to consider consider the quality of this uh, because everything just kind of falls apart but it's okay if you don't touch it but yeah uh, so overall I'm not sure if I recommend this but yeah so buy some of this down in the description box below along with all my social media pages down in the description so if you want to join physical alternative bricks, I'll put a link down in the description box below as well. But thanks for watching. I'll see you very soon.